Good day and welcome to the Procon YouTube channel. My name is Michael Klump and I'm a technical support consultant at Procon. Today I'm going to demonstrate features of Probot 2D's retaining wall wizard. This video will discuss the input parameters of Probot 2D's retaining wall wizard and will demonstrate how to save a default retaining wall wizard file, how to load a Procon retaining wall design file, and lastly, the plotting and scheduling of rebar entities. Probar 2D, open up the retaining wall wizard and assign a name for the retaining wall and member. The retaining wall name gets allocated to the drawing and the member name gets allocated to the scheduler. Using the dimensional sketch reference for the wall parameters, specify the relevant dimensions of the wall. Define the type and spacing of the vertical, horizontal, and starter bars in the front and back cross-sectional location. Define the type and spacing of the top and bottom main bars as well as the top and bottom lacing bars. Specify the cover for the back and front of the walls, as well as the cover for the top and bottom of the base. Lastly, indicate the required lap length factor for the rebar splice locations. Should you wish to adopt the same parameters for the detailing of other retaining walls, you can save the above specified parameters as a default. Using the same default parameters, you can plot an additional retaining wall with slightly adjusted parameters into AutoCAD's model space. In the retaining wall wizard, you can also load an existing retaining wall design file, specify a wall and member name, and once again add it to AutoCAD's model space. You can optimize the bending schedule by making use of the drawing selection modify command to renumber and optimize reinforcing. Lastly, once the bending schedule has been optimized, you can paste the bending schedule into AutoCAD's model space. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. For more tips and tricks, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get notifications.